Australia just lost the World Test Championship final. No backup, no second chance. Now imagine doing this to your database. Losing critical data is just like losing a final. There's no replay. There are two common ways to delete a database in SQL Server first. Just right click on that database, hit delete and confirm it. Second, using TSQL. Just run drop database. Chris, both methods remove your data permanently. No undo, no rollback. Just like losing a final with no plan B. Most important, dropping a database deletes all data permanently. Restore is only possible if you have a backup. Before you delete, think twice. This isn't a test. What real DBAs do? In real environments, professionals don't just delete a database. They do it the right way. Step one, take a full backup. Step two, verify the backup file exists and is usable. Step three, only then, drop the database safely. Always backup before delete. No exceptions. Policies change, audits come, user asks. If data's gone, it's gone.